Sitting there with Tony and those guys, you know what I mean? It was just, it was some hard goodbyes in there. Love those guys. Love Coach Hogerson to death. The opportunity he gave me to come here and, you know, further my career as I'll, you know, never be able to repay him for that. And our relationship stretches way beyond football, and so it'll, that'll continue. But great opportunity, you know, look forward to it, and uh, just wish we could have went out a little better way here tonight. One day, do you hope to look across the sidelines and kind of be a Dana to Kevin Sumlin in a situation like they had? <laughs> yeah, it wouldn't be bad. When the offense did bog down a long time, so can you put your, is there anything in particular? Was it just lack of execution in one part and then another? Or you know, I mean, I thought they made plays and made it tough at times. You know, I thought that their um, their defensive front probably played better than what they've shown on film. And so a um, little high. We were high on four or five throws, intermediate throws. And so I think it's just if you put all that together, and if you put it together at the wrong time, then you go three and out and make things tough. And then it makes it even tougher when, when they're going down scoring. You know, so then you're you're behind the eight ball, and really, you know, I thought we I thought we could have been up by a little bit at halftime. You know, we let it slip away from us a little bit, and then the, the third quarter we went out and just halfway through we wouldn't get anything. We went two or three drives in a row, and we came out flat. So that was probably the story of the game. Howard's throws being high, just a product of his excitement, or just you know he missed a couple, and that's just what happens. Sometimes. Yeah, I mean, I don't, I, you know, if I knew that, you know, I would, I would. Wouldn't be here right now. So I mean, sometimes you you just have high balls. You know, I mean, it's just the way it is. Sometimes you're not as accurate as you are other times. You know, I thought he did settle in and make some good throws at the end that, that got us back in the into at least striking range. But you know, at the beginning of the game, he did start off a little high, probably amped up a little bit, and so I, we were hoping that the game would settle in and he would he would straighten the ship. And I think for the most part. I mean, he played well late, you know, later in the game. So he battled his tail off, though, I tell you. I mean, I'm proud of his mindset and the way he just played, you know, lights out as far as effort-wise the whole game. You know, second start, I mean, the kids got bright future.